One thing I like a lot going back to the drilling, and I've been doing this more and more with my students, I recommend it, is having it's tra- teaching the other party to be a good training partner, to give you the correct feel. So if I'm drilling with you, let's say a double leg, I want you to resist 30, 40% intensity. Do exactly what you would do when you go live, no power, no speed. Because then you give me the reactions I can expect when I go live. Because the worst thing is for you to drill a move and because you're mad, or you practice a move in a certain way and then you're doing something I didn't know you were going to do, I'm, I'm surprised by your resistance or by your reaction. I go, oh, I don't know what to do now. Oh, that move doesn't work. Yeah. Where it's a way of getting your student used to the reaction they're going to feel, they're going to encounter when they go live. It's also a reality check because if they're doing it wrong when there's no resistance, now they know, now they're, it's, it's, they're exposing me. Even at 40% resistance, their yeah. mistakes are exposed, right? And then it also, what it does is it reinforces your teaching. So if sometimes, I'm, I'm sure this has happened to you, it's happened to me a million times, where my instructor would give me a move or a detail, and I go like, that's stupid. Why does he do it like that? Why don't I do it this way? Because I know, right? I'm a blue belt. I know everything. So I would do things my own way, and I kind of ignore, you know. But when you're, when you're met with, with real resistance, you immediately understand why your coach gave you that detail. That's when the detail makes sense. And it's when it makes sense that you go, oh, got it, right? I'm the kind of person, maybe you are, a lot of people are like that. They, I have to learn by failure. Like, that's the best way for me to learn. If I do something, it doesn't work. Or I, have to be, I have to understand in a, in a more physical way. Because you can tell me, don't stick your arm in that triangle. I'll probably do it until you catch me three or right. four times. Yeah. And that, to me, it's the really best way of, that's the true lesson, right? 